So, ladies and gentlemen, we finally got to the meat and bone of the whole uh, Record Store Day Hall, where the it finally matters most, and that is, like I said, the records. Okay, so, unfortunately, I didn't find what I was looking for, per se, because I wanted the uh, Coheed and Cambria, and maybe the uh, uh, Run the Jewels, uh, Tote Bag, and maybe Big L, and it was, you know, some of the stuff that was on the Record Store Day list, and unfortunately, I didn't see anything, or whatever. Only thing I did see of a uh, Record Store Day related was Biggie Smalls LP, and like I showed you in the other video, like I already have, I already bought a, 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 a Notorious B.I.G. Uh, CD, so it doesn't really make much sense getting an LP, you know, I mean, it's like, so I decided kind of like, you know what, I'm going to get something totally different, something that I didn't hear before, because let's be honest, we all heard a Biggie song. No, no disrespect to Biggie per se, but it's just kind of like, okay, dude, we get it, <laughs> you're a legend and everything, but at the same time, get someone else a chance to kind of like shine a little bit, I guess. You know, because it'd be kind of boring just to listen to the same thing over and over. You know, maybe not unless you really, really love it. But I'm just saying, you know, whatever. Anyway, get back to what I was talking about earlier. So, the first record of uh, the hall, the U Hall, I guess, is this album. Uh, Fat Joe and Remy Ma, uh, the, the, the collaborative uh, album that they put out. A plata or plama, or I think I said it wrong. I'm pretty sure I said it wrong. Plata or plomo, plomo. Uh, yeah, uh, I think that's right. Yeah, I think. Don't get me wrong. Don't anger me. Not just playing. Uh, anyway, so yeah, uh, I, I saw that and um, like actually I was super felt kind of super indecisive of like what exactly I wanted because I also saw um, Buster Rhymes and and, and um. Eminem uh, collaborative effort on uh, one song that they put out, I think it was last year, you know, it's like the same song, but like six different times, and I was like, I really want that, but I don't really want an LP that plays the same song, it's like, might as well just play the same thing on Spotify, and just play it over and over six times, and that's basically the same thing, right, you know, I mean, kind of like, I'm kind of cheating me a little bit, whatever. And I also saw uh, Michael Jackson, uh, Bad. I wanted that, but I didn't really want that. Not super bad. Hey, pun! You know? <laughs> so, yeah. Anyway, so when you open the gatefold, you see this. And damn! I ain't gonna say that, you know, because she's damn. But she's not free market anymore. I think that's all messed up, like free market or whatever. Anyway, uh, and here's the back cover, and, um, <clears throat> actually, I wasn't really want to get this album, but it's just, you know, Fat Joe and Brent Ma, you know what I mean? Um, <clears throat> there's, like, not really a lot, I mean, not a lot of uh, features that really caught my mind, caught my attention, but, uh, the one, the two, or actually three, is, like, uh, French Montana and The, Dr the Dream and Ty Dolla Sign. You know, that, uh, Ty Dolla Sign, if you've never really heard... A full album by him, you're missing out, you know, because uh, if just check out um that LP uh, uh um free TC, I mean the songs I would I would I would recommend on that album is uh Horses in the Stable, um Blage by uh featuring uh, Ray Tremor and Future, and uh, there's another one uh well the whole the whole album is just banging and uh. Since he's like the main the main star, I guess. I think you know that that's basically one of the reasons why I picked it up because you know like Ty Dolla Sign is amazing. Um, the the uh, French Montana appears a few times here, like three or four times. Uh, be the Ch Chicago hit and uh, uh <clears throat> sorry, uh, much like T Ty Dolla Sign, uh, be the Chicago kid. Uh, no matter what song he's on, he he touches the gold. But I, I don't think I've actually heard a full album from him. Um. So if I sounded winded, I'm just kind of excited, uh, you know, just, just kind of, just kind of, yeah. Anyway, and then the second album I bought is a classic, a classic, 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 but it's not a hip-hop album. It, I decided to kind of like, like one hip-hop and one something else, 
And I'm not going to jump right into it and just kind of spoil the surprise. But instead, I'm just going to kind of drop some hints because that's why I like doing dropping some hints. So, it's, um, it's a respected band from the 80s that kind of like made an album in the 90s. And a lot of the core fans hated it because they thought they sold, sold out, which I think is a stupid term. But it is... And if you haven't guessed yet and don't know what the hell I'm talking about, because I'm bad at, at, at giving guesses, giving hints, boom! Metallica, the Black Album. And uh, if you don't really care about the commercial sound or whatever, this whole album is gold. I mean, Enter Sandman, Sand but True, That's But True, um, Nothing Else Matters, uh, The Unforgiven, wherever, my ro wherever I May Roam. I mean, most of the album is hits on here, you know? Uh, yeah, sorry, I need to breathe. I forget to breathe. Ooh, I don't know. Anyway, I'm gonna be undead. Ooh, that's why I'm wearing this mask, because I maybe I might be undead. I don't know. Uh, I'm not. Um, so yeah, this classic album right here. And, uh, that's basically it for the Record Store Day haul. Um, all three stores, everything. And if I did all three uh, segments into one video, it'd be too long for YouTube. I don't know what it would do. It'd crash. Anyway, so that's pretty much it. You know, and uh, if you like my channel, please give it a like. And don't forget to tell your friends and families and neighbors, you know, and, and people you might know and might not know. And just tell your uh, everybody else, tell everybody at a reunion or something, you know. You might want to get together with your old friends, you know. And... That's it, I guess. Uh, my voice is getting high. That's weird, right? Anyway, something you never heard before. Anyway, um, that's pretty much it with the channel. Well, it's not with the channel. With this video. Anyway, so please give me a like, subscribe, and don't forget to comment below. And I don't know why would you comment. I guess you would. <sighs> okay, so I'm out like the flash and see you with another video.